Chapter 46 The idols of Babylon, Bel, and Nebo are being hauled away on ox carts. But look, the beasts are staggering under the weight. Both the idols and the ones carrying them are bowed down. The gods cannot protect the people, and the people cannot protect the gods. They go off into captivity together. Listen to me, all you who are left in Israel. I created you and have cared for you since before you were born. I will be your God throughout your lifetime until your hair is white with age. I made you, and I will care for you. I will carry you along and save you. To whom will you compare me? Who is my equal? Some people pour out their silver and gold and hire a craftsman to make a god from it. Then they bow down and worship it. They carry it around on their shoulders, and when they set it down, it stays there. It cannot even move. And when someone prays to it, there is no answer. It has no power to get anyone out of trouble. Do not forget this, you guilty ones, and do not forget the things I have done throughout history. For I am God, I alone. I am God, and there is no one else like me. Only I can tell you what is going to happen even before it happens. Everything I plan will come to pass, for I do whatever I wish. I will call a swift word of prey from the east, a leader from a distant land who will come and do my bidding. I have said I would do it, and I will. Listen to me, you stubborn, evil people, for I am ready to set things right, not in the distant future, but right now. I am ready to save Jerusalem, and give my glory to Israel.